I crushed my first Marlborough Sauvignon Blanc in 1983, and uh, the first plantings were in 1981. So I guess I was here right from the beginning. So uh, we used to take all the fruit from Marlborough, take it to the North Island for uh, for crushing. So we grew it here, but no one had a winery, so we crushed it 24 hours away by truck. And was that kind of exciting? Uh, it was unknown at the time. You know, we had the vineyards down here and no winery. We didn't know what Marlborough Sauvignon Blanc was really about. And it was only after probably 84, 85, where we really realised that we had you know, quite a unique proposition here in Marlborough Sauvignon Blanc, that um, we put a bit of effort into it. Before that, it was just another white wine that we thought we might put into bag in the box. We have um, the environment which seems to create the fruit that, um, with time in the bottle, on, on lees, it develops very, if you like, champagne-like characters, uh, brioche, toasty flavours from that, from that interaction, and um, while still retaining some lovely primary fruit, but without too much emphasis on the primary fruit, so quite a complex, savoury, toasty, nutty wine. Thank you.